Hey guys, welcome back to this Minecraft Let's Play. This is Civic Dude, and I think we're looking at episode 8 now. I've got some really cool things to show you. I'm really excited about this episode, guys. Um, I've been pretty busy since the last time you saw me. Um, least of which, is, or not least of which, is this new texture pack that I am in love with. Uh, this is some, this is a texture pack that I think suits my, my, uh, my tastes just perfectly. It's... Uh, it, re it reminds me of um, a, uh, like a comic book, or if anyone's ever played the Legend of Zelda Wind Waker game, um, how it's very very animated. It reminds me a lot about that. Um, it, anyways, it's called Sfax Pure BD Craft, and hopefully I got all that pronounced right. I'll have a link for you in the description, but it comes in many, many different resolutions, and it is well updated, and... Um, I re highly recommend you guys check it out. I've been very pleased with it so far and um, can't wait to show you guys. So let's just dive right in. We're going to go to the Let's Play world. And you can see, very animated. Isn't it cool? I'm, oh, I'm so excited with this. This is the 128 pixel resolution. So it's pretty smooth. And we'll see how this, we'll see how this works on this computer. Hopefully it holds up. But I got a lot of things to show you guys. Been doing some digging over there. Check it out right here. I made a second level for my my little farm slash barn type thing, and I even enclosed it with a little roof. Did a lot of digging to get this done. Let's see if we can go check it out up here. So it's pretty high up here. You sheep, you be quiet. Y'all are a little too loud. So I took advantage of the upside down half slabs mixed with regular right side up half slabs. And I think it's coming along nicely. I haven't quite decided, but I think I'm going to put uh, pigs and cows up in the top here. Possibly some more sheep, but uh, definitely some pigs and cows to make this a full-fledged full fledged barn. And you can see I had to do away with my chicken coop. It was just uh, too much in the way for right now. I'm going to have to move that somewhere else for the, for a little bit later. But I still have this other little guy. He's doing good. He's doing just fine. So let's see what else can I show you guys. Oh, let's go check out our NPC village. And it's uh, you know, still under construction. I'm absolutely, absolutely in love with this texture pack. It also comes with uh, a few different uh, skins for the mobs. So we'll be, hopefully, hopefully, we'll see some, some random mobs here. Maybe not now because it's daytime, but that's okay. Oh, and let me show you from a far distance so you can actually see this because it looks pretty cool. It took me a little while to do it, and it's a little tricky because of the uh, suspension part of this bridge, but once I got it looking right, it's pretty cool, I think. So here we go. Check it out, guys. Nice little bridge there. little pathway going that way. Still need to put... Ooh! Hello. These look. These squid look different. Different colored squid. I like it. <gasps> There's clay. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm going to have to go get that. By the way, clay shows up so much better on this texture pack than the other one I was using. Or even the default. The default was hard for me to see sometimes. Okay. So, let's go up here and check out this village. Not a whole lot is going on. The main thing apart about this was the bridge. Oh, we couldn't quite make that jump. That's okay. We'll come back and get it from this side. And let's see if we can find a good way up here. A little bit more. I've got some... i got one, th one thing I want to build with you guys in this episode, and I'm going to keep that a surprise until just a little bit later. But... For now, let's just look at this NPC village. Get some music going here. There we go. Actually, let me turn that down a little bit. That's a little loud. Actually, let me turn this down a little bit, too. Huh. Oh, no. Let's put it back in there. Let's turn it down a little bit more. No. Uh, We'll just have to walk far away from it. 
So, you can see I've got glowstone in here right now. I think I'm going to switch this out for redstone lamps. Zombie, what are you doing? Let's go check out and see if we can find this zombie. Because he should have a random skin on. And I have a sword. Ooh, I like my flowers. They're pretty, aren't they? Okay, let's go check out this guy. Where are you? Come out and fight me like a dead man. Where is he? I know he's close. I know he's close. Maybe down there? Let's go see if we can find him. Oh, broke my ankle. Where are you? Well, this might just be a waste of time. <laughs> uh, well, you know what, zombie, you'll live. I'll come back and get you later. Woohoo! Oh, squiddy. Squiddy, squiddy. Okay. Let's go back into our base here. I've got one really cool thing to show you guys. Or, one more really cool thing to show you guys. You can see here's our barn. But I... Oh, we're going to go away from these guys. They're a little loud. I've been doing some research and some studying. And I think, I think I finally got it the way that I want it. Check it out. It's my own customized player. Oh yeah, you guys may recognize this from my, from my uh, avatar that I have listed as my profile picture on on YouTube and a few other places. But uh, I'm pretty happy with this guy. It took me about a day to to get him to where he is now, and I think we'll keep him. We might make some tweaks in a little bit, but. But right now, he looks pretty good to me. So we're going to keep him like that. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Oh, yeah. What I wanted to do... And we're going to need some stuff. We're going to need some some tools. Okay. Um, pistons. Need a piston. Preferably a sticky. Sticky piston. There's one. That's all we need. And let's get some bricks. Where do I have my bricks? There. Maybe here. Mm, there we go. That should be enough. Okay, we got bricks. We got that. We need some water. So we need a bucket of water. One more thing we need. Mushrooms. That's right, folks. We are making a mushroom patch. Okay. Now to find a good place for this guy. Hmm. Oop. I think I see a good spot. Let's put it right down here. Yeah, I think this will work out just nicely. Okay. So, let's do a little dig in here. And dig that out. That out. That out. Let's see. I want to put it kind of like this in here a little bit and it's probably dark there we go okay so we got three that way is that how I want it? let me think let me just dig this out so I can see what I'm doing okay three that way no, let's do it like this. Let's just do three wide total. Yeah, that's right. Uh-oh. Where's that zombie? This area of the mine, of the cave is not fully safe. So we could... Could run into a little problem. Especially if Minecraft freezes. Where are you? Show yourself. Oh, oh geez. Whew. Okay. We'll have to find him eventually. I got a feeling, though, that he's going to find us. Somehow they always do that. Okay. Tell you what. I'll be right back. I'm going to go uh, 
get this design a little bit better. I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, guys, here we go. I think I've got a pretty good, or a decent design at least. We'll see how it works out. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. So we need to dig out a little bit more over here. Get some working room. Some room to work. And I can't take full credit for this design. I was definitely turned on to it by a generic B. It's a pretty good design for this. It's pretty simple, but I mean, it works, does the job for the old mushroom farm. I'll, I can't remember which video it is, but I'll try and link the specific video of his in the description. Okay, let's see. Let's place. Oh, that's a brick. That's fine. Let's just place that there. And we're going to need. Let's see. How does this work? That like that. That like that. Place that there. Get my torch back. Okay, now. Right now. Let's. Oh, we're gonna need to dig out a lot more of this. Jeez. Get out of my way. Okay, one more row ought to do it. Yes, I could be using a much faster tool to dig, but real men dig with stone tools. That's what I've been told. So that's what we're going to use. Okay, now we need right here, put one of our mushrooms. And let's go ahead and cover that up with the final block type. Next one, let's put right here, cover it up, and then we need one down below here, the other color. Can I do it? There we go. Okay. So that's going to be where our mushrooms grow from, and they should, from according to Generic B, they should grow um, just fine. Inward is what we're looking for. Inward, that is. And if not, I can scoot them closer together. It's not a big deal. Okay, so let's go ahead and lay a little bit of this out. And like that, that. Okay, now our water is going to come from this one right here. And we're going to break our pick here in a second. Because that's the plan, of course. So what we need is our piston to be right here. And it's going to push down this block by default. So our water is going to be there, flow out, and scoop up our mushrooms. Okay. So let me go get another pick real quick. Unless I have one. I don't have one, of course. Sprinting, sprinting, sprinting. More picks, more picks, more picks. Okay. And more bricks. Need more bricks. Let's just take them all. Take them all. Okay. Oh man, I'm so excited about this texture pack. It looks so flippin' cool to me. Okay. Now we need to run some web some whetstone. Yeah, which I didn't grab. Jeez. Come on, Civic. Pull it together. You gotta get better at filming these episodes. They're gonna run way too long. It's a couple we need one torch and we need a lever. We have no sticks. It's okay. We get a stick. One stick. Okay. Lever time. There we go. Quick swig of water. Because talking a lot makes you thirsty. Slash dries your mouth out. So if anyone asks, yes. It is difficult to do sometimes. Okay, now let's dig some more. With our broken pick. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's get up here above the situation. Get a bird's eye view of what's going on. There we go. I figured I would break into this a little bit. So, that's okay. 
We'll just cover it up with some cattle. There we go. Clean that up later. Okay, so what we want to do... Uh, let me see if I can remember. We want to power that block. Let me throw down some light. Not there. Back there. Okay. Not that block. We want to power... Not that block either. Which block do we want to power? Um, oh, wait. Hold up. No, that's right. So... Want to power? I think I'm doing this wrong. You guys can correct me in the comments because I'm sure I'm doing it wrong. Oh, there we go. Power that block. Okay. Or is it this block? You know, I don't really know. No. Nope. What the? What's going on here? Where are we trying to power? You guys saw that. Okay, hang on. Let's go check out our practice world. Okay, we just made this. Shouldn't be able to, should be able to remember it. Okay. Power the block behind it. Oh. Uh -huh. Okay. I had the right idea. I just forgot. Okay, back to the real business. Oh, I see what I did wrong. <laughs> okay. Let's get our stuff back. We need to be back one more. That's what's wrong. Okay. We can do this. No, we can't. Dang it. Don't want. Okay. We'll get this. We'll get this figured out, boys. No problemo. Actually, let me make that out of cobble so I'll remember which piece it is. Okay. Oh, are you kidding me? Come on. What is this doing? What is this doing back here? I have to cover this whole thing up. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Come on. Come on. Okay. Cover that. And that's where we need the wire to go. Right. What? You gotta be kidding me. You've got to be pulling on my leg. Let me make sure no other blocks are obstructing this thing. This is apparently very finicky. What? Come on, we just talked about this. Maybe it needs to go into it like that. Okay. So apparently this is not actually powering the block that it's on, it's powering the block above it, which would be this block, or actually, sorry, this block. That's what's going on. A lesser, or a more experienced redstoner would have known that. But I claim no redstone if <laughs> efficiency. Okay, so let's see how we can wire this up. Hmm. Well, we're going to have to do something along the lines of... Oh, gosh, we got to get rid of these blocks. There's no room to do anything in here. Out of the way. One more. Okay. Now, what we need to do is right there. We're going to reverse the signal. That way it's on by default so that the water will not flow. Does that make sense? Okay. Now, all we have to do is tie it in up front somehow. 
And let's see. What's the best way to do that? I'm thinking. Now go with me on this. I'm thinking that this may not be the best way to do this. Nope. One more piece. There we go. Now let's see if we can cover this up well enough. Well enough to call it good. Probably not. Crap. Well. Hmm. And I guess that cuts the signal off, doesn't it? Okay, so we don't want to do that. So how else can we do this? Well, I don't know at the moment. Hang on, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I figured out a pretty good way to do this. All I had to do was move the lever over one. That allowed me to use this method where I could place a redstone torch on the back side of that block so that whenever the lever is off, the redstone's powered, and whenever the lever's on, the redstone is off. And now what I have to do is place a block here to get the signal to go through, and it works just fine. Okay, so and I'll be able to cover it up too, which is what I was looking for. So let me do that real quick and cover all this up, and then we can start testing this little guy. Oh, jeez. We fell. Okay, I'm going to have to probably replace most of this with uh, the actual stone brick that I want to use. But for now, let's just do it like this. Oh, yeah, this is going to work out so nice. Okay. So that like that. Now let's turn it off so we can place the water down. And let's get out of the way so we can turn it off. Here we go. Oh no. I see a problem already. See, the, see what I'm talking about? Oh wait, I know how to fix it. Watch this. Oh no. Nope, not a problem. Not a problem. Problem solved. There we go. So we'll turn it off here. Turn it on here, and we'll go right here and collect our our stuff, our mushrooms. Okay. So that's pretty good. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna close all this up with the actual material, and I don't think I need to leave any room for anything, especially light. I don't need any any light in here. It needs to be dark. So we're gonna cover all this up with cobble because, oop, dang it, because we don't care. And yeah, we'll cover that with cobble for now. Okay, so let's do. Oh, we're running out of bricks. Jump on. Okay, let me go make some more real quick. Okay, here we go. We got our bricks. That wasn't that wasn't too bad. That just took what a couple seconds for you guys. Not bad at all. Okay, Minecraft, don't be slowing up on me now. Okay, now I haven't done any testing with how the mushrooms grow, but I th think they grow just fine with only one block of space. Oh boy, I heard a skeleton. Let's get out of here quick so we can defend ourselves. Okay, a couple more. There we go. Looking pretty good. Pretty dark in there. We should see some mushrooms growing in a few hours. I don't know. I'm not sure what the spawn rate is. But, anyways, that should wrap it up for me, guys. I want to just do that with you. You know, a little something to show some kind of progress in this game. I might clean this floor up and make it bricks I don't know but uh, I'm really excited about this texture pack I think this looks flipping amazing and I just wanted you to be here with me to share in my joy and excitement because that's what we do in this game
It's fun. Okay, I'm just going to clean a little bit of this up, and then we're going to call it an episode, guys. A little bit more. Probably way bigger than this thing needs to be. Oh, no. Don't need that one. Need that one like that. Okay. Oh, crap. That's going to screw this whole thing up. Dang it. Should not have done that. Bad decision, Civic. It's okay. We can fix this. We're going to place it like that. Torch there. Brick there. Brick there. Okay, now we can just tunnel out of here. I think. <laughs> we'll find out, won't we? Oh, yeah. We got this. We got this. Come on, guys. No problem. You guys know me. No problem with any of this stuff. I'm an expert at this game. And I'm totally just kidding, by the way. Okay. There we go. That's looking pretty good. Might even make a door here. That'd be kind of cool, huh? Okay, guys. Well. Oh, no. Lever. Duh. Where'd the lever go? There you are. Lever. Yes. Still works. Awesome. Oh, look how much darker it gets. That's kind of cool. Okay, guys. Well, I want to thank you for... <laughs> look at this. <laughs> kind of looks like a, uh, a welder's helmet. You know what? I'm going to leave it on. Okay, guys. I want to thank you for being with me, joining me on this episode. Check out this texture pack. And rate, comment, and subscribe on this video. Let me know what you think. Um, stop back. We'll have some more adventures in my next episode of Minecraft. We'll see you guys later.